welcome to another episode of Mystic Cider playing Subnautica. Now today, um, I wanted to give you guys a little update, and as you can see, my Seamoth is, or not Seamoth, Prawn Suit is a far ways away. But before we get to that, I wanted to show you some new things. I got us an aquarium. There's currently nothing inside of it, but I got us an aquarium. This now has two power cells. Um, the Prawn Suit now has a pressure compensator, so it goes to 1,050 feet. Um, we have all the nuclear reactor. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but reactor rods. I have them here. I plan to make as many as I can, but I don't have enough uranium right now. I have plenty of lead stuff. But So there's that so far. And um, I found... I want to get to this. I found a new precursor base. I think is what they're called, precursors. Um, <laughs> I was searching because it turns out this cryonite thing, I think, is... Or, I don't know what is it. Um, hold on. Let me get over here. Um, uh, anyway, it's down like 900 meters, which was our limit. Yeah, this... Oh, kyanite. It, it's found in uh, caves deep down, so I was searching for those. I also found another thing for a drill arm, which we definitely need. But anyway, um, I was searching for that, and I saw this green light, and I'm like, what in the world is that? I go over, and it looks like one of those little lantern things. So I take the, I'm like, okay, I wonder if this is another base. I go in, I look at it, I navigate my way through, and it's a base. So, I didn't have any of my artifacts on me, so I made two more. I didn't even know we had ion crystals. But now we have as many purple artifacts as we can have. That way I think that'll allow us to get in, unless I'm missing something. But I'm gonna get us... Oh, you can't stop right now. I didn't just sleep recently. But anyway, um, I left that the prawn suit there as a marker so I could get back there. So I'm gonna travel there now. I figured out my little thing here. So what I do is whenever it gets low... Sorry, this is kind of loud. I grab a power cell like this, replace it, and put it on the charger. Move around. This one's at 90, so it'll take one out. Go here. Oh. What in the... Why are both at 90? It's not right. One goes in. Oh, I forgot to unload it. Dang it, that was idiotic. Alright, hang on. So now I stick it in. Man, it really looks like I know. Oh my gosh, I cannot do this right. Goodness, guys, I'm sorry. This is this is a nightmare. Okay, so now we're back up to 11.99. So that we got enough power. So now I'm gonna head over there, turn off internal on external, and um, I have officially been attacked by a uh, Reaper Leviathan. Um, that is a thing that has happened now. In case you guys were wondering, it what it does is it kind of like latches on and just drags you pretty much with it in your face. So I found a wreck. It's down here. You guys can't see it because it's been black. But um, there's like a dunes area, and I found a wreck there. So I took the cyclops and the prawn suit down because I that's where I found my drill arm. Um, I came down with, like, the laser cutter and stuff like that so I can open up the doors. And then with my prawn suit, I said, okay, we'll keep searching. So I started walking with the prawn suit, and then it just, like, comes out of nowhere, grabs onto me, and I'm at, like, 80% energy, or not energy, health. I was at 90, 96, and it dropped me down to 84, I think. So then it dragged me, like, a thousand meters away before it finally dropped me. Um... So yeah, that was an interesting, interesting thing that happened. It was kind of scary, because it just, like, grabs on, and I, I didn't even hear anything. I wasn't expecting it, and it just grabbed on to me and freaked the heck out of me. However, I know they don't do as much damage as I thought they would. I wonder why there's those. Is that a secondary wreck? Oh, no, they're reef bags. Okay. Sorry. When I was looking down here, I was down at the bottom, so I never saw anything up here, and I couldn't hear anything. So, I think those are just reef bags. I hope that's not a wreck that I'm completely missing. But apparently there are plenty of leviathans. I found the leviathans don't do a whole lot to you. Let's start dropping here. 
The Leviathans don't seem to do that much damage. And then they don't do a whole lot of damage to the Cyclops, I noticed. Which I am not surprised about the uh, Cyclops part, but... Whoa. Oh, we must be by a mushroom. Yep, I didn't even know that. We could have run into a mushroom or something. Okay, I'll keep keep descending though. So yeah, um, this this little section that it's in is pretty much empty. It's like a crater, almost. Okay, we're nearing that. You'll see it kind of dips down into this like hole, and then it's just this one little bit of light. I haven't seen any life down here though. So you can see there's our there's our prawn suit. So we'll drop down a little bit more. Check on my cameras. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this thing. Oh, okay. Here we go. Now I can kind of see around us. Alright, we are good. Perfect. So I'm gonna turn off all our lights to hopefully save battery. Alright, so we can go down. That's ah, right there. Disoriented. Ah, there it is. Alright, so we'll jump in here. So you guys can see what else we're talking about. Aboard, Captain. All right, we have lost one energy since I left this thing, because I can't figure out how to get the lights. Okay, so keep moving down here. All right, so I just followed these, like, torch things. I don't really know what to call them, lanterns. And I found the terminal, so... So here's this. It gets kind of chilly down here, though, I notice. Insert artifacts. We've got three more. So now we can enter. Jump in here. All right, now let's see if there's anything in here. I really hope there is, but I mean, there's a possibility that it isn't worth it. Um, oh, don't tell me now you're not gonna let me in. Please, don't do this to me. You're really not gonna let me in now. It's too deep for the sea moth. Oh my gosh. Wow. Alright, apparently we're gonna have to- Oh, okay. Ooh, this looks really cool. A bunch of ion crystals. Not gonna do anything to them in case I set something off. Ah, data terminal. Data terminal. Don't know why I said that. Okay. okay. Thanks for the ion crystals. Oh crap, I did not see you in here. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. Well, that was pretty cool. There wasn't a lot to see. Unless I'm... Are you gonna let me in? Come on. Dang it. It's not gonna let me through. Our suit is too big. So we'll just have to enter normally. But it doesn't, it looks like that's about it, but this is pretty cool. I'll look at that data here when I get in the exosuit, but... Man, this is cool. Oh, jeez, hey buddy. Yeah, I've been figuring out I can kill these things pretty easily. Alright, but guys, we did it. We found another, I don't know if you could call this a base. Don't even start with me. Don't even start with me. Would you quit it? Thank you. Okay. So we made it in. That I guess that was pretty cool. We can look at that data now. Let's see what that is. Alien data. Biological history. Uh, it was grown from... Okay, um, this all means absolutely nothing. Okay, alright, well that all means nothing to me. So, it seems like this crater was made specifically for it. Um, there doesn't really seem to be anything else, unless this is, I bet this is something like a meteor. Could that be what this is? Because it's all just rock down here. 
What is that noise? Do you hear that? Okay, that wasn't it. It was kind of like a electronic voice sound. This looks like a trench. But why would there be a trench? What good would that be for a trench with a single rock in it? Um, I'm a little confused. I wonder if I need to maybe... Is there like a way... Is that like an entrance to something? That's being hidden? Possibly? I think the drill arm is allowed to destroy these things, that's... But it doesn't look like there could be anything. Looks like it's just empty. If you guys know anything about this, please let me know in the comments. I would really like to learn about this. But I don't know... Anything else? Well... There you have it, guys. It's another base. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. <laughs> I made a stasis rifle. So, I'm gonna probably head back and test that thing out for you guys. So, because I've never used it before. I have no idea. Oh, I missed the door completely. E e oh, dang it, I missed the door again. Okay, there we go. I eventually got in there, guys. Captain. Old systems online. I need to jump in here real quick. I just need to check the storage here. Ah, uh, there's all the crazy amounts of silver ore that I found. No, stop it. Okay. And up. And in. So we're gonna bring this back to the base. Um, I think we'll be able to get some more vehicle upgrades, if I'm not mistaken, with the new uh, stuff that we have here. Okay, that appears to be nothing. You know what? Let's explore. Why head back when we can explore new areas? Okay, so we'll go down over here and see what this is here. Get my cameras here. So I can kind of get an idea. If there's even there, it, this just could be the end, or there could be all kinds of things down over here. Ooh, it's really dark. I know that. I'm gonna get a little bit closer to the, uh... Whoo, it is really deep purple. It won't let me move. What's happening? Did I hit, like, the end or something? What the heck? Something... Holy crap! What in the heck was that? What is happening? Are we hitting... Oh my gosh, what was that? And there's floating lithium. But what the heck was that? Something just like rammed our our thing here. Holy crap. I can't tell if that was like a game bug or if there is something down here that just beat the crap out of the ship. Because that was a loud bang and it tipped the ship. Holy cow. A little worried, but curious. Ooh, stop going down so low. Okay. Caution. Dehydration detected. Okay, fine. Vital signs. Vital signs. Stabilizing. Okay. Stabilizing. Okay, happy, thanks. Alright. Oh. You know what, actually, I'm gonna see what kind of... 
outcroppings these are here. So we'll get the prawn suit, because I do not, I'm not going alone out here. I am taking this thing with me. Holy crap. Alright, so let's see, is this limestone? Yeah, it's just limestone. Kind of worried to stay out here too long. Because I don't want to, you know, get flung all over the place. Is that something back there? I could have sworn I just saw something. I could be hallucinating. Just because I'm nervous. I do that. Okay. Well, I don't see anything so far. Do not fall down there. There's going to be, like, no way to get back up. Okay. Um... Appears to be nothing. I hope I'm right. But I still want to explore a little bit. I keep missing the door. I keep thinking it's closer. Come on, get in. Get in, thank you. Alright, I need to trade out the power cells here. So I'm going to turn the lights on so I can see a little bit better. External. Ah, it's not going to let me. Alright. Internal. So we can see a bit better here. Power cell. Not on this side. Okay, so it's just this one. So we'll grab this. Go in here. Trade that out. And put it in. Alright. So now. Turn the internals off. Alright. So. I'm going to not learn from my mistakes and continue to try to travel out here. But again, I want to get close to the ground. That way I don't get, I don't like drag attention too much. Alright, so now we'll start to descend. Move over, oh jeez. Gotta move over to this side, though. Man, this thing is hard to control. Okay. Travel out, and then to this side. Okay, that should allow us to kind of line up more with the ground here. So we can travel. Oh, jeez, I did not see you there. Oh, jeez, okay. So now we can rotate this a little bit. Go down. Oh, there's a cave. Sweet. Okay. Oh, it's not letting me... Is there like an invisible thing here? I must be missing something. No? There is no cave. Oh, well, I'm crazy nervous. How deep are we? Oh, we're really close to our limit here. Let's see if it'll let me go deeper. I'm catching on something, but I don't know what. Any deeper? Why am I listing forward, and why do I keep hitting those? You know what? Whatever. I think this is a lost cause. It's not going to let us go down, so we'll just abide by its rules and not go. We'll go up a little bit more. Alright. We couldn't have gone much deeper anyway. Oh well, guys. Sorry I wasn't able to go down. You guys are probably like, no, you could have. You could have just kept going, kept going. You were so close to something, but oh well. Um, but I will probably... Oh yeah, I labeled these. Huh. So the mountain is obviously the mountain island, and we have um, the base set as base one, and the floating island set as floating one, and the entrance to the aurora is set as aurora. Why was that spinning so much? I don't know if you guys saw that, but that piece of metal was just like I'm freaking out there. Okay, so I'm gonna actually explore this now. Let's see. See if it'll let me. If there's even anything there. There could be absolutely nothing. But hey. 
It's worth trying. Oh, jeez, that's really close to the ground. I didn't realize it. Alright, so we'll jump back in here. I thought I was gonna head back. You guys thought I was done. Apparently, I'm not. This is probably not gonna hold anything. Yep, nothing. This was a whole load of nothing. If anything, it's shelter from the Reaper Leviathans. Okay, that's the opposite direction that I want to be going. Whew. Okay. Oh, Reaper Leviathan. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna hang here for a second. So the Reaper Leviathan starts to, you know, go away. While we're doing this, I might as well jump into the storage and grab this stuff. While I'm here. Alright, now I can know. Get back in. Alright, so we've got a bunch of silver now, though. Okay, is it safe to come out, little Leviathan? Am I okay? Sure. So, ah, there we go. And we're in. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I expected that to go a whole lot worse. Alright. So, we'll head back. Whoa! There's ground there. Okay. So we'll head up. See, this is the dunes thing I was talking about. Hey, Reaper Leviathan! Hey there, buddy. What the heck? Hey there, buddy. You are freaky. You gonna try to eat- Oh, he's trying to eat the warper. Hey, buddy, I'm, I'm sorry to tell you, but you can't really do that. Your roar is awesome. Can I just say that? Your roar is extremely, extremely cool. Wow. Wasn't that cool, guys? Some of some people are probably like, it was just a noise. Some people are with me. Some people, what the? Are you trying to? Oh, hey, buddy. Who you scared me? Hey there, you're trying to kill me, aren't you? Well, I'm sorry. I rule the waters, despite what you think. Okay, now I got it. It's so frustrating. If there's another way to get out of the cameras, please let me know, guys. I keep hitting E. Ugh. Or C. Whoa, there's a wreck there. Is this the wreck I've been to before? I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, this is the wreck that I've been to before. This is nothing new. If I am not mistaken, this is where I found my first drill arm. We'll see if it looks similar. If I don't ram into that. Jeez, oh, hey there. Stop trying to eat me. I don't fit in your mouth. This may be different. I could be wrong. Nope, nope, same one. I guess I'll check. Go ahead and head in here. Up in the prawn suit. Let's hope the Leviathan doesn't come try to rip my face off. Do not hurt me, Leviathan, please. Pretty sure I've been to this one. I think if you go up here, this looks like it. Oh, maybe it's not. Drink that. Nope, definitely. Oh. No, it's not. That's not the right one. This is not. Maybe we'll find the other end of the drill arm. That'd be nice. Unless the doors reseal, which wouldn't make sense. Glad I checked. So let it die. Ground. Alright. And in the suit. 30 seconds. Yes, I know. Die. What happened? Okay, I'm here. So now I can travel through here, up here, down through here. Another door. Why do you do this to me, game? 
This better be worth it. I'll have to throw this in the uh, battery charger. In the Cyclops. Okay, now I gotta get out of here. Yes, I know. Thank you. I think there's a mode where it doesn't give you the um, oxygen warnings, which sometimes would be nice, and sometimes I really need the warnings. So it all just depend. Not pretty sure this is pretty sure this is a different room or a different thing. Another door. Open this up. Holy cow, this must be a heavy door. Oh, that leads right outside. Okay, then. Well, now that I know I can get over get over there. So I can travel into these other places seconds. easier. Not that I'm gonna move now, because Leviathan's there. Who is, again, trying to rip my face off. We'll go back over here. Down. Round. Come on. Nope, we're gonna spend all of our oxygen time trying to get in. Alright, is that another one? No, I can't enter that one. Okay. That leaves right outside. Did I miss anything? Pretty sure I didn't. Pretty sure I got everything. Yeah, that's just water. Okay, there's vents, but I don't think those are gonna take me anywhere. Yeah, a whole load of nothing. This may be the same one. It looks ex very similar. But, I mean... If you think about it, in the real world... A lot of ships could have been... Oh, uh, it's opened. This must be the same one that I've been to. Some of these are opened. Yes, I know. It's gonna talk about my hunger. Or how hungry I am. Oh, no, I haven't been to this one. Even though it's not even gonna play any music. What is that? Apparently it's nothing. Portion. Blood nutrient levels decreasing. Aren't you gonna tell me about Calorie Oh wait, no, I was at 36 oxygen. Okay, now it's gonna let me in. Okay, is there anything to scan? No. I could have sworn I saved, so... I don't know. Um, okay, well, apparently this is a whole load of nothing. Like I originally expected. Okay, running out of oxygen now. I'll jump in here. I don't know how it's getting all this oxygen. Where is it getting it? That'd be a question I would like to know, because it's just, anytime I jump in, it has infinite oxygen. What? <sighs> Dang it, I thought those would be something I could get. Dang it. I still can't believe it's a whole load of nothing. Wow. Okay. Well. Alright then. That sucks. Thought I found something, guys. 30 seconds. Oh well, now it's just a matter of getting back without getting eaten. Yeah, I don't remember opening that. This looks very similar. I think we were in the wrong one. Of course, guys. This is my life. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Thank you. Alright, now we have to make it over to the Cyclops, which is... Oh, it's right up there. Eh. Think we're headed in the right direction. Yeah, those look like the doors. Come on. Get in there! No! Please don't kill me, Reaper Leviathan. Okay, I think I'm... I think I'll be okay here. So jump up... Oh, please don't come Reaper Leviathan. Am I not gonna have enough the rest? Oh, jeez. And I missed. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's try this. Please don't come and eat me. Please don't. Oh, 
okay. Whew. Okay, that, there was a smudge, and it looks like the silhouette of a leviathan when it's off in the distance. All right, get me in there, get me in there, get me in there. Yes. Welcome Holy aboard, crap. Captain. Did you guys see how All close that was? Online. Oh, well, I am officially just going to head back. So, I'll see you when I get back there. Okay, guys. I forgot to tell you that I finished off our solar panels and made them to the best of my ability. Made them evened out. So, to the main event. Stasis rifle. Let's do this thing. So, I need to find something that I want to... And let's try a rabbit ray. Why not? Oh! Okay, this thing is a little bit hard. Ah, oh, dang it, I keep missing. I'm bad with this thing. Oh, this is cool. It has a giant range. Holy cow. Oh, I can do it short. Oh, so if it's a small thing I want to shoot at keep it small or I can go full range and make it a giant one so this would be like Reaper Leviathan thing right if I were to try to freeze one of them yeah I would think so man that thing is cool I could literally just go around and shoot stuff for a while I could this could last me a while I'll try it on a more vicious animal if I can even end up hitting it, who knows? I'll probably end up dying trying to hit it. Do, 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 do. Ah, here we go. Oh, I see. Oh, now I can scan him. Sand shark. They're called sand sharks. I don't know how long this thing lasts. Alright, let's go. Aha, we. So that's how you scan things like that. You need to get your stasis rifle. For me for pronouncing that right. Alright, so that makes a lot of sense. Would a little one work for it? Yeah, because it's a small, small fish. Okay. That's really cool. So you've been on for things like that. Oh, crap. fire to make sure you hit it oh no as soon as you oops <laughs> what if I do inside oh it instantly goes off so now it's outside oh that's cool oh, that goes the whole way out into this <laughs> oh that's fun Well, now we've seen it. Let's see, what's our little information about this here? The sand shark. I've only done a biter, a stalker, and a sand shark. Slow but powerful predator. Okay. Forward dorsal fin, kind of like similar to a shark, obviously. Segmented exoskeleton. Thick armor plating on the organism's back. Relatively unmaneuverable, but almost immune to any attack from above. It's fear ill designed for ambulation likely used to disturb the surface of sand. Oh, okay. Prairie herbivore is up to twice its size. Use caution in sandy biomes. That's pretty much what I do. Okay, so we can get rid of... Voice got shaky there. Um... Okay, there we go. I'm trying to keep that sorted there. Okay, so... Straight out. Alright, so we got full battery. Yeah. Alright, so we'll go here. Nope. Here we go. This needed a new battery. So we'll get that charged up. There we go. And then this one needed a new battery. Just throw that one in there. Oh. Oops. Here we go. And you had how much battery? 93. You're good. Alright, so now we can get rid of these. 
I have my flashlight just in case. Well, guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Sorry if it was a little long. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next, next episode. See ya.